The newest feature available to Renscribe users is a redesigned shoes section. To access the shoe section, you'll need to log on to your Renscribe account on the web dashboard and select shoes. Shoe type can have a significant impact on stride mechanics, and the new shoe profile shows you how. In order to take advantage of this profile, you'll need to tag your runs. First, you'll need to add shoes to your profile. From the Shoes tab, select the New button. Fill out the New Shoes form. Once you're done, the shoe will automatically be included as a tag option from the Run Detail page. After you upload your next run, view the Run Detail and simply select the correct pair. The shoe profile allows you to filter your metrics even further by terrain, workout type, and pain points. It can be a powerful way to evaluate which shoes perform best in different conditions, so we recommend spending the time to tag after your run. It will provide deeper insights over time. Here we have an example of a runner that has a very symmetrical and efficient stride in these hokas. But when we view the data by terrain, we can start to see some differences. On a treadmill, the runner's efficiency drops slightly, but their symmetry and shock both look good. On the road, the profile changes as a slight imbalance shows up in the runner's motion. Their pronation and pronation velocity shift while their shock increases. Using Renscribe, this runner can evaluate how they perform in the same pair of shoes on different terrain. And with this information, they may opt to use their hokas on the trail, but go with a different pair on the road. With Renscribe's real-world metrics, you can now quantify the impact of variables like shoes and terrain on your stride. We hope with these tools, we can help you make better training decisions. Good luck!